So you're interested in making wine. Great, I'm going to show you how, step by step. Today, we're going to start off with our kit from Wine Expert. Here are all the ingredients that come with the kit. We're going to start off by cleaning and sanitizing our equipment with our Easy Clean Sanitizer Bacterial Cleanser. Now we're going to add a half a gallon of hot water to our sanitized fermenter. And we're going to stir the water vigorously and then add packet number one, our bentonite. We're going to stir vigorously while adding our bentonites to prevent any clumping. We're going to now add our juice to the bentonite and water. So we pour in our juice. Then we're going to add a little bit of hot water to our bag to make sure we get all the juice out. Now we're going to top up our fermenter to the six gallon mark. We want to make sure that we use room temperature water approximately 65 to 75 degrees. We want to make sure that it's not too hot or not too cold. Once we've added our water, we want to mix everything together, our bentonite, our juice, and our water. So we're going to stir vigorously for about 30 seconds. Now we want to take a hydrometer reading. We can use a tall glass or a wine thief. We're going to put a sample of the wine into the thief and then insert our hydrometer into the wine thief. Make sure that your hydrometer matches your reading that comes with your instructions with your wine juice. If anything else came with your kit, like oak chips, elderflowers, Make sure to add it at this time. So now we're ready to sprinkle on our yeast. Now we're going to cover our primary fermenter with the lid and the airlock. Within 24 to 48 hours, you should notice your airlock having some bubbling action. That means your wine is beginning to ferment. After five to seven days, it's time to transfer your wine into a clean and sanitized carboy. In step number three, we're gonna add our remaining packets, packets two, and three, stir it into a half a cup of warm water. And we're going to pour those into our carboy. Then we take our end of our, our spoon and we're going to stir vigorously. Make sure you don't skip this step. It's very important to stir very vigorously for several minutes. And we're gonna add packet number four directly into the carboy. And we're also gonna stir that in vigorously. Once you're done stirring, and put your rubber bung and airlock back onto the carboy. Then in approximately one week, we'll be ready to bottle. Okay, moving on to step number four. It's time to bottle our wine. We're going to take our Firmtech Auto Siphon and we're hooked up to our Ferrari bottle filler. So we start our siphon 
and it's going to fill our bottle up. When it gets to the desired level, it's going to automatically stop and just simply move the filler to the next bottle, press down on the button, and it'll start to fill your next bottle. Now it's time to cork. So we rinse and sanitize our corks. Take a cork and we put it in our double lever corker. We're gonna put that right on top of the bottle, press down, and voila. You've got a perfectly corked bottle. We are a quick phone call away for any questions you may have, or you can also check out our FAQ section of the website as well as our online videos.